Good morning. Good morning, how are you? Good. Good. It's not as cold as I thought it was going to be. What's that? It's not as cold as I thought it was going to be. Yeah. Well, it doesn't look like there's too many people coming today. I think what we're going to do is head out. You got a light. For three bucks. Nobody showed up today. No, it's more for us. <laughs> oh, I never thought of that. I thought I had a fucking. Just mm. fucking do it. Mm. Jack O'Neill's pockets, or is that O'Neill's? <laughs> it ain't under the truck. <laughs> It's pretty cold out here today, guys. It's like uh, minus, it's gotta be about minus 14. Well, it feels like minus 14. It's probably about minus seven.
No one hears him. Yeah. Wow. Oh, that's a good deal. And it works good? Uh, that part I have to... You haven't tried it out yet? I have to figure that one out. I'll probably go easy home with it. Yeah. And then they'll tell me some plugs or whatever. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. And it's a laser feather, but it's a little bit heavy too. Mm-hmm. What time is it, Patrick? Ten to eight. Ten to eight. No, I don't know. I'm hoping she comes. Otherwise, I'm walking. <laughs> no, I'm okay. Yeah. If Michelle comes, I might take a bag because I'm going to be carrying another lunch too. I just want to carry it <laughs> while I'm going home. It's incredible the power those things have, eh? It just cut through that fucking uh, snowbank, like that pile, like nothing, eh? Went beside the van too, he's good. Yeah, I'd be scared to clip the van. While we're driving, I think that van moved. Ha, ah. That must be hard to steer, eh? Right? Because the steering's in the middle. Your pivot point's in the middle. Oh, really? It's a short turn, eh? Wow. Yeah. Not much that can stop those things, I guess, eh? Yeah. Do you hear they were shelling a fucking uh, nuclear station last night? They attacked a nuclear station. What kind of idiot shoots at a nuclear plant? We don't care. No, eh? Yeah, yeah, I remember. So was uh, that the, some of the other countries around there that are now independent. I wonder if he's going after them too. He's gone mad. Yeah. 
He was quarantined for six months. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he's gone crazy. I heard his speech he gave, and it's all about how Ukraine's full of Nazis, and he's liberating them from the Nazi threat and stuff. Like, just fucking loony. My shirt, my shirt, that little North Korean buddy's gonna come over too now. Oh, yeah. Wait, wait, wait until that's finished. Takes he wants, Taiwan. He wants to blow up the U.S. And take Taiwan. <laughs> if he touches Taiwan, that's all bets are off, eh? I was watching a video on the numbers between uh, NATO and Russia, and if they ever went head to head, NATO would crush them. Like they, it's like 30 different countries, eh? All at once, they outmatch the Russians in everything. So. Yeah, but nobody cares. We got we got all these fucking bonds. Mm-hmm. Get rid of them. Mm -hmm. Should just do that anyway. Mm-hmm. Nobody showed up today, Paul. Nobody? No. There's no Ed. There's no Chris. That's okay. There's no Isaac. Isaac. There's no what's his name? Sh uh, Jesse. It's okay with me. <laughs> no Catherine. I hope Michelle shows up, otherwise I'm walking home. Uh, I don't mind walking, it's just, it's nice when you have a ride, right? I was saying, that thing's pretty amazing, eh? Like, how, look at, it cut through that snowbank like butter, eh? It's pretty impressive power. Isaac's attitude was. What? It winds up his middle finger like that. <laughs> I've seen him do that. That's funny. When it's not at you. <laughs> but he's just fooling around. He did that to Chris. Ah, okay, so he's funning. An hour longer to go to the regular grocery stores. I'll take a coffee, uh, double double. That way you don't have to reach for them if you want. Yeah, to move on. So I don't. Uh, oh, you want a coffee? Can you have, uh, one more coffee? Tea. Tea. And his son's father took his hand and started hitting me. Mm-hmm. So I grabbed his hand and grabbed his arm and like that. Yeah, like a uh, karate kid. Yeah. Nice. I should tell him, I told him, did you do a wax on or wax off? <laughs> That's funny. Oh, I heard it. Yeah. Thank you. It's you know, a play on words. Jack he, off, would you jack him off? No. It's a play no, on words. No, but if, he, if let's say, if Jack was... I heard was, that grade seven. Yeah, me too. Well, if Jack was to help me off the horse, I would do that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I would jack off. <laughs> <laughs> he got me on that. What? You got me on that one before. You already tried to. I remember. I deliberately stayed a half hour because I want to go to Goodwill and they open at 9. So if I got here at Which 7, one? The one on Lincoln, eh? There's something down there I want to pick up that I thought yesterday. Anything good? I won't say what it is until I have it in my hand. Ha, 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 okay. Yeah. Uh, nice. Well, actually, the Goodwill is right off of Lincoln. It's right on uh, Plymouth Road. Mm -hmm. I always thought that was on uh, Hellams. It's on Churchill. Churchill, yeah. Hellams ends at uh, Lincoln. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Churchill. I think what everybody, they saw the cold weather and they thought it was like really, really cold. So they oh. saw it and they thought, no, we're not coming. Suddenly within 10 minutes, it gained 3 degrees. It's nice now. 
Like my, my pits are actually sweating a little. <laughs> but I got like four shirts on. <laughs> Young Danny reads his piece and walks away. Then he says, Oh, you got my pizza? I'm like, Here. Oh, no, you take it. I'm like, and I put a little jam in there. I say, He's a stupid idiot. <laughs> well, what, what I heard is he got hit by a car the other day. That's what I heard. Yeah. Yeah. Danny Mark. Oh, Danny Mark got hit by a car. Hmm. That's what I heard. Oh, all right. Yeah. No, bad, no big loss. Well, I hope the person who hit him. Got charged, well, well, yeah, you don't go hitting people. It doesn't matter who it is. No. If you're an asshole driver, you know, Yeah. Because it could be a good person he kills he next. He exits anymore. you got to understand that. Oh, yeah. But it doesn't matter who you are. If you can't drive where shit, you shouldn't be on the road. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I think what he means is if anyone got hit, at least it was somebody like Danny. <laughs> One day, I had my camera. Mm -hmm. And a guy with an ATV was on the uh, a path. I'm not gonna say where. Yeah. I turned around and snapped a shot of him. And saw me. <sighs> Move. I thought, oh shit, I better delete it. <laughs> and there was some birds on a pole. pole. Yeah. And he said, I hope you didn't take any pictures of me. I said, no, I took pictures of the birds. You want to see? Were you in public? Deliberate. Yeah. Oh, I would have said, fuck you. I'll take pictures of whatever I like. So, I um, deliberately took a picture of the birds just to show him I took something. Mm -hmm. And then he backed all the way up, mm -hmm. almost to where a certain spot, mm -hmm. and my camera could zoom in so good that, let's just say, he could uh, be at the white car. I could zoom in and get, get his license plate on the TV. That's pretty good. And uh, big enough you could read what's on it, okay? Well, I sent it to the city to the mayor and said, hey, you know, just let you know, I don't know who, uh, you know, they forwarded on and the guy got nailed for uh, using the ATV in town. Oh, so they did get him. Oh, wow. And there's an excuse why I took it. He gives me a, well, you shouldn't, you know. Well, he shouldn't be there. If he goes over a certain spot and hits somebody, and then I hear about somebody got hit by an ATV, then I already have his license plate. You might want to look at this guy. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. Mm-hmm. There's another thing I want to tell you something. What? Marilyn did some volunteering, and Danny Marr was very, very demanding. And soon went back to Gina, Marilyn. Are those steel toes? Go ahead. Step on them. Oh, that's cool. No, they're not. They look like they are. They're not. Wow, that's nice. Are they comfy? Uh, yeah. Yeah. They're actually used from Goodwill. That no, place you're going to? I was using them for, uh, went, no, I got them at the other one. I used them for newspapers. That place you're going to today, the Goodwill there, yeah. there I got combat boots, brand new one time. Brand new, they, and they were only selling for like 60 bucks. Yeah, I got them brand new. I just, they came in that day too. And they were my size. I wore them out in six months. Block the sun for you. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> I'll be a jackass for you. Yeah, you are a jackass. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you need to back to the real story here. Marilyn went back and filed a complaint with Gina about Danny Mark, and Gina went after Danny Mark. That's good. Yeah. Yeah. He gets away with a lot of stuff because he's old and he's, you know, like he, he well, pretends he's all old and stupid. But he thinks he has authority, and he's God's gift. We got a black guy not, not too long ago. Yeah, I heard, heard that. About that. Well, see? But he has this, you know, I'm in charge. I want to look like I'm important. He's not important. He's not. I don't think he could be any less important. And I remember what I also told you, Aaron Carter's been hanging around with him. Think about it. He always has. And I go, why? why? Even when I fell in love with him, like, I hang around with them and that table? Why? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And with Carol? And I'm like, mm -hmm. all those years is probably what did it to her. Mm -hmm. That's why I said, remember, I'm not going to talk to After this bullshit, I'm going to get back. Thanks for coming out today.
I told you guys to I will. Thank you. Have a great day. <laughs> She's always sucking up to somebody to get. Yeah. Yep. Influence. Yep. And you told me that uh, she was not thankful for the story that you gave her. Yeah. There you have it. I bought her a fifty-dollar uh, CD radio thing. Mm -hmm. You know, square thing about this big. Yeah. Didn't even thank me. Really? Ah, oh, that's that's not right. But all I have and, to say is... And you just did it as a goodness of your heart? She doesn't want to take it, that's the end of it. Yeah. And I'll leave it at that. And yeah. That's how snobby that girl is, eh? She does tend to react a little snobby, yeah. Yeah, that's for sure. She's gone downhill since about six months before Deborah left the Hope Center. Oh, so because you think that's... Deborah and Aaron got into a, an argument about something. Right. Aaron started to, well, this is my opinion on something. Mm -hmm. They didn't like something. Mm -hmm. And Aaron started to get this hard-headedness. Right. That's... I've always wondered about Stephanie. She seemed to be different before, but she's, now... She's selfish. That's she's all. very shy now. And I'm also saying, too, that she's very, very selfish. She wants she wants everything. Like I said, she wants everything to her fucking self, that Stephanie girl that Aaron Carter has been hanging around with. Yeah. Why did they break up, those two? Aaron? Yeah, and, and Stephanie. Because they, they used to up? Well, they used oh, to yeah. pal around all the time. Now they don't. Neither of them hang out with each other. Well, probably because Aaron's got into this little, small world. And it's, it's sad that what's going on in her head, mm -hmm. I don't mean as in, you're nuts. Mm -hmm. I mean psychologically, that doctors can't help her. Mm -hmm. Whatever, I, now I can't say what it is. Mm -hmm. Kind of like psychological, psychiatrists kind mm -hmm. of keep my mouth shut. You mm -hmm. know? Well, you know what but I think? But it's sad that she has to deal with Is she seeing thing. a doctor? I don't know. No. Well, I think the reason why Steph and Aaron Carter Car, C A R R. You know what I mean. Car. Yeah, no, they had a breakup of some sort. Yeah, I definitely. I think what it is is she found out that Steph would want all the attention, mm. and uh, you know, for herself. And then I think that's what it probably have a bad calf fight. Mm -hmm. Calf fight. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. With that. But yeah, Stephanie thinks. What's the bulldogs are everything. What's the wheels under the center for? Oh, so you can put uh, it and have four wheelers. Really. It gives you better traction. Like That's John pretty cool. Brother. See? You get four wheel drive. Ah oh, ha ha! That is really cool. Nice. That is really cool. I've never seen one like that, like that. I have other ones, but they don't fit properly. That's really cool. I've never seen one like that. I gave Ed one with four wheels, but it was one of the four wheel, the four wheels on the. Is that the, front. the blue one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you gave that blue one. Yeah. yeah. Don't forget the money. Yes, you know, I will remember. I'm so sorry. I, my, um, you know, John, Guitar John, he, he comes in once in a while. He, this way he comes by here. I've heard of him. Yeah, he comes at, a, he plays at a Borderline and stuff. I don't know. I owed him so much so that I, I, I paid, but I got everything I owed for him. So I got one other person um, I owe, you, and that's it. And then, and uh, Express, I owe Have Express. You seen David? The guitarist, the one that's kind of like... No. Kind of like frail. No, no, no. He used to play it on... Thanks for coming and doing this today. There be some leftovers too, guys. Have a great day. Thanks. Hey, Mike. How are you today? showed up a half hour later. What time is it, guys? About eight, ten, uh, probably eight. Almost eight. The bells haven't gone off. It's got to be close. The bells haven't gone I got a, it's gotta be eight. Yeah, it's gotta be yeah, close to. What's eight. happening today? Staying awake. Yeah. Uh, that's weird. Did you hear the bells? I didn't oh. hear the bells. Maybe they didn't go off today. But I'll leave you see that the video you take me the other day while I was joking with. What's his name, eh? Yeah. How'd you do that while we even realized it? I don't know. No, I mean, the camera was right on us. You were just sitting at the table, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
Yeah. Did you see that? Yeah, that, that it was funny. You had everybody laughing. It was this? awesome. Oh my god, I don't believe this. That was funny yeah. shit. I think Rick likes the attention. Yeah, he does. He's not a bad guy. Yeah. And he, he knows you were good. Really <laughs> I know. I know he's like he likes the uh, he likes the entertainment and and the comedy. Yeah, he's a good guy. Rick's a good guy. Awesome. You grabbing a coffee or anything, or you got one? Eh? I got tea right now. Nice. No more junk food for anybody. I, I don't think that. Michelle's coming today. I quit all my garbage now, eh? So yeah. A couple of Italian cookies I brought nibble on. I like them. For only yeah. a buck. These cookies here at No Frills. Yeah. They come in a see-through package. I don't know if you've seen them, but uh, I threw a few in. These fat ass cookies here. They're only a dollar. Oh, cool. A dollar for these. Cookies. I've seen those kind. Those are, and they're light, right? Very they're light. Very, yes. Yeah. They're, they're healthier. They're not sweet, eh? So. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I grab. It was a little chillier today, eh? A little bit? A little bit. Sunday's going to be very nice. That's what I hear. It's going to be so nice. Yeah. Yeah, I'll be here on Sunday for sure. say thank you from her, not you. Sunday, it's going to be nice to show up. I wasn't going to come anymore because I had no more junk food to give everybody. I thought, well, no reason to You don't have to come. You don't have to give away stuff. Somebody told me, Look, get your ass out there and socialize. That's, yes. Yeah. That's lot good of, for you. A lot of people enjoy seeing you. It's good to socialize. Yeah, I guess I could. Mm -hmm. That's mainly why I come out. Yeah. Nobody came today, though. There was just me and Zim here. Paul showed up. Yeah, I can not believe that nobody was there. Yeah. I almost didn't bother. I almost didn't either. I almost didn't, but the only reason I came was because I knew I had to give, see if I could get some smokes at coffee time at the Express. The only reason why I came... I knew Zim would miss me if I didn't. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well, I know you would. <laughs> secretly, you would. <laughs> I would not miss you at all. No, but secretly, <laughs> secretly, 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 I would not miss you. <laughs> Did you see my uh, the little Keyshawn uh, in the video? I, he was wanted to get recorded, and I this one. Oh, that's last the night the, uh, the little boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Those are the two I seen. I seen that one, yeah. and I seen the one with that, that thing there. Yeah. Two brand new videos you had over. Yeah. Yeah. I almost didn't go either because uh, take another chocolate, take it home, and then uh, heat it up. And put the chocolate I almost in didn't uh, come because uh, I knew it was gonna be cold today. But I said hell and go. Mm -hmm. There's no snow on the ground, right? So no. no it was actually slippery yesterday. Oh, the way. It in there. Mm. Very slippery. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What's that little thing there? It's not not no. Is it a little toy camera? No, no, no. It's a light, flashlight. Oh, light. I yeah. hope Michelle shows up. Otherwise, I'm walking home. I don't see why she wouldn't. Well, she was pretty tuckered out that? yesterday. Are you guys closing, are you? Okay, you guys closing? What time is it? 8 30? Oh, well, it's 10 after. 10 after. 10 after 8, eh? Um, I think I'm okay. I'll check. Let me check. Oh, Mike, I got something else for you. I'll see how much tea I got in here. Mike, he's got a chocolate bar for you. Oh, he's got to be kidding me. Grab a chocolate bar. Oh, that's nice. Thank you. Put that chocolate um, I'll get a tea and I'm gonna add to this, okay? Chocolate bar it's here. Sweet or milk that way it won't get melted from the tea. Pushes chocolate in there. Yeah, it's rich. Rich yeah. chocolate. Good old rich chocolate. Don't put it in there, it'll melt. In the bag? Oh yeah, your oatmeal might melt it. Yeah, it shouldn't be that hot anymore. I don't think it'll melt in there. You put, it with your, okay. you put it in your tea, or not with your tea, if you have coffee. Or even your outside pocket. He didn't put anything special. He didn't put anything in that he shouldn't. Just no. Huh? <laughs> no. I just test, test no, eh? Just no. You never know these days, man. Never Nobody's going to waste that. alcohol on you. Doing good, good. Going for a walk every day. You walking outside or the mall today? Yeah, this is nice, isn't it? Yeah. What do you got planned today, uh, Mike? Ah, uh, bike ride. Nice. I might go to St. Catharines. I don't know yet. That's cool. I used to go. Well, there's no snow. It's I'm definitely really a nice warm. day out for it. I'm dressed really warm. I haven't been there in a while, you know. I, I like bike ride, I mean. Do you I actually there. bike out yeah, there? Yeah, I do. I used yeah. to ride there. I'm, I'm very physical, eh? I like yeah, to be yeah. active. Any fat that's on me right now, it'll be gone. Mm -hmm. The weather gets better, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
You know, it's cold. It's freaking warm. This one that Ida gave me. It's yeah. warm as fuck. I don't know why it's so heavy. It's, it's like putting on a piece of uh, metal. It's like there's something heavy inside this coat. It's the weave. It. See the uh, weave? The weave, the type of material? That's a heavy material. It's got like, feels like this bead. But it's probably it. waterproof, eh? No, but it's very warm. I love no, it. I bet you it's waterproof. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Did you go to the coffee house for me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who was all there? Uh, Teresa showed up. Rick was there. Uh... Zim was there. Same crowd as yesterday then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same, same group. Oh, I hope Michelle shows up. It's not too bad. Oh, you're not dressed for it, right? Not really. You should have dressed for it. Did you check the weather? Mm-hmm. It was nice going to Tim Hortons yesterday after being able to sit inside and mm -hmm. socialize with people, eh? Hello. Good. Oh, let me get on the way here, man. <laughs> I see your neighbors moved in, eh? Ralph. Dinner. Ralph moved in yesterday. My brother's brother. I'm not in line. Yeah, move out of the way. <laughs> no, Danny Mark got hit by a car the other day. That's what I heard. He told me, I said, Tim Mark. Yeah, yeah. He's walking, though. He said, mm -hmm. That guy's getting sued. I said, Well, if he was in the round, yes. If he wasn't, you would be the one in trouble. Where did mm -hmm. that happen? He said, Over on Niagara Street by that uh, BMO, I mean, Bank of uh, Niagara Region. Wait a minute. Mm -hmm. The, uh, what's that bank called? The green one? TD. And the trust. Yeah. TD. He said, It happened out there. That's, I can't handle, I can't stand that intersection. A lot of people are getting hit though, man. I know that. You get all these Toronto people that don't give a crap from it. They don't Anybody want to be judgmental is. on that. You know what I mean? Everybody's out for themselves. Your life is no more valuable than a squirrel when you're on the road. Yeah. Than a squirrel. When you're on the road, it's no more valuable than a squirrel. That's funny. True enough though. Mm hmm. I never thought of thinking it like that. <laughs> yeah. Rumors got it that. You get more ass than a toilet seat, for Christ's sake. <laughs> you know that? Me? You get more ass than a toilet seat. That's pretty goddamn good. I don't just I'm not talking about women's. I'm not talking about getting sex. I'm talking about men's ass. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. I don't want to that's what I've been hearing now. <laughs> I had to throw that in because I didn't want to think his head fall and think he was getting the other. I don't want a man's ass. Chris seems to want to drop Isaac, I could understand. I kept telling him. You keep checking for Chris's butthole. Maybe Isaac, I could but see. I, oh, I tried to hint to him to pull his pants off. Who, yeah, Chris? Yeah. Hello. No, Michelle? Not, no, no. I don't know what I'm going to do. Next time he does that, I'm going to say, I spy with all the lies. Why is Chris here today? He's usually always here. Chris is always here. It was crazy. Unless he's gone on the bus all the town or something. Could be. No, no, no. We had it all planned. Next time he's got his pants down, I'm going to say, I spy with my little Aya. What kind of goodies do you get to wait over at the uh, street on the street? Uh, clothing or shoes? Yeah, or? yeah, 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 yeah. Did you get yeah. any shoes or clothing? No, I didn't. I didn't. I, I got these from them about three weeks ago, so I'm okay for boots. Somebody just give him a tater chip. So I just gave that up. I can't do it. I'll make them last. I just gave it up. I can't go back to that. You gotta be around. Yeah. Hey, you wouldn't want to give me a ride home after, would you? Yeah, I can do that. Awesome. No, Thank you. Yeah. Wait. Yeah. Okay, read, read that bag. I'm curious. What kind of chip is uh, that? Barbecue. Uh, they're like jalapeno type thing. I think it's all dressed. Spicy. Oh, yeah. Jalapeno was. Yeah, yeah. Jalapeno. <laughs> Before I get that from? No. I get that from uh, Trailer Park Boys. That's funny. Secretly, I says, I don't miss you. <laughs> oh, John Mellencamp goes to some, some people are no damn good. That's John Mellencamp. Mm -hmm. He's right about that. Anybody want chips? I think you got more up there, guys. Everybody can get a bag. Chips, the only one that's not allowed to go. Dwayne, get up there. Oh, you can't get any either, Paul. That's that's okay. Okay. <laughs> me only me and Dwayne. Are allowed uh -huh. to get chips. Yep, there, Dwayne. Hurry up. He's really like taking the bag. 
Hey, do you have a bag? A spare bag? No, only this one. That's the only reason I don't want to take extra. I have a bag, but you it's can't bad enough I'm carrying a bag lunch. I have one, but you can't touch it. You don't need a bag. You got a bag already. Is it? This. By me, if you get a ride with uh, somebody, you'll be. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah, I'll be all right with Patrick. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, pretty right. girl. I gotta get my mind out of the gutter. Nah. <laughs> I might not be allowed to cook junk food. You know why? Mm. I quit yesterday, gave everything up. For some reason, I got a chocolate bar and bag of chips. <laughs> just like Isaac, stop smoking. <laughs> trying to tell me not to stop or what? Some kind of little small voice. Well, you stop for the day. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm supposed to stop for the year, guys, not for the day. Mm -hmm. What happened? Uh, the sun is nice and warm. It is. It is very nice. Sure is. It's turning out to be nice. It's only supposed to get to like 32 to 34 today. Oh, is it really that bad? Okay. <laughs> what what would 32 be? That's like zero. Eight, that's zero? Oh, that's not bad. Yeah, I like that bag. It's black. I don't see it's black Oh wait, you should see the wheels underneath. He's got two spare wheels that drop down to make it a four-wheeler if he needs it. Oh, you can go four-wheel with that? Yeah, those wheels wheel stay drive. up, but if you want it, it goes down. Watch. It'll it'll snap down. There you go. Look, 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 and then it's four wheels. It's for going up and down stairs. No, no, that's the three-way where they spin. Where they spin around. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking of. Yeah. That's one of the that's the kind of gave Ed. You notice what I did? Oh, you probably didn't know if I did. You know how they don't like me putting my junk in the paper bag. Yeah. My junk in the paper <laughs> bag. Didn't say it to anyone. <laughs> I didn't even notice. <laughs> I see my neighbor at Tim Hortons the other day. Yeah. I didn't want to knock on the door, but three days my ceiling's been leaking. My ceiling. What? It's been leaking through the light fixture in the bathroom. He That's put, not good. He just put a brand new floor in, he said, the other day, a couple days ago. Yeah. I didn't think he'd do anything. I told him about it last night. The leak's gone. Right. Awesome. Right on, buddy. Nice. You fixed it. That's good. Keep in mind, the longer he doesn't fix the leak, the more damage he's gathered to his property. So it behooves him to fix it quick. I know what you mean, though. Some landlords, they just leave it until... Or they think, you're the stupid one, <laughs> and then you leave, and then you don't know, but you know. You mm -hmm, know what I mean? Mm-hmm. You haven't got anything like that in your apartment, eh, Dwayne? No, Leaks? no, no, no. Did you say your place is smaller than the one you moved out of? Yeah. It is? Yeah. I moved out of a two-bedroom into a one-bedroom. i seen your video. It's like a long hallway. Mm -hmm. Like, is your living room, kitchen, all one room? Or? Yeah. Uh, yeah. I get it. Small. But it's all we need, really. Yeah, if, I, if I take my finger... I don't, I don't need it, but... I'll it says press. It. <laughs> <laughs> You're missing the under part. Free press. Oh, so it doesn't cost it. me. It doesn't cost. It's a free you gotta, press. You gotta do that and go How many times can I do that? As no, many times as you like. Yeah. I have a whole what? bunch of... Um, that, but go in my car, uh, like this. a comforter. Oh, nice. And bed sheets. <gasps> yes, I, I need bed sheets I need. How do you know I need bed sheets? Ah, that's amazing. That's amazing. Couple, My, um, couple sets of sheets and a really nice comforter. That's awesome. My wife this. goes through so many, and I have to yeah, have some on absolutely. standby. Well, you know what? I just bought a new comforter set and everything for Christmas. Thank you so, so much. I put up that dump video last night. Oh, did you? Yeah. <laughs> you were very brave. Oh, man, it was cold. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I could have done that. Right? Mm -hmm. And you, you guys raised over 2000 2000 bucks? So we ourselves, so that was actually four beyond. Mm -hmm. So the dump was because we did the coldest night walk. Mm -hmm. And we hit our, we didn't hit our um, uh, our goals, but um, well end. Do you have your phone on you? Their goals. Yeah.
pull up my video and see what I did for the write-up for that. The latest video, it'll be uh, it'll be called Ice Dump Challenge, Ice Dump, and just see what I did a write-up. I, I think I mentioned that it was put on by the True Roofing Reno and True Roof Reno and Steel for Beyond the Streets, uh, pertaining to the coldest night of the year yeah, event. Yeah. That's yeah. yeah. And what is the write-up about it? What does it say? Write up the description. Can you click on it? Yeah, and then read me the description, what it says. You can touch it. It takes the... Yeah, yeah, there you go. Bring it down. What does that say? City Hall told the Breakfast Club they... No, won. no, 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 no. City Dump. It's called uh, Ice Dump Challenge. It'll be the latest one. Oh. The latest video I just put out. Oh, my God, that's an old video. <laughs> oh, it's probably because you're in the... What's it called? Breakfast Club. No, no, no. It'll be the latest one. Latest video of mine. Uh. Hmm. I don't know. Anyway, you'll have to check yeah, it out. I'll check it out for sure. But I think I wrote it right. Yeah. I think I wrote it right. So, um, Brad Alt, he put together like a fundraiser and collected all these uh, gift cards. Hey guys, thanks for joining me. Uh, basically, not as many people as we thought were going to show up to Breakfast Club. Um, but thanks for watching. I really appreciate the views. I will see you guys on the next one. Everybody have a great, great day.